and a, and an immigrant who's she dying to be here. And take advantage for the American dream. Take the 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 dream. So Smoke and Mirrors is about that constant challenge of trying to sift through the information that we're fed every day through media. And it's an exploration on how that is shaping our reality and our social consciousness. So I think we all know that, you know, the internet with its misinformation, its algorithms and and echo chambers, um can lead to a lot of polarization so i wanted this song to be a reminder to not let division uh distract us from the things that really matter so when it comes to my creative process i usually have two modes the first one is when i am inspired by a story or an experience and uh, I'll usually sit with a guitar and let the story and the emotions dictate the chord progressions, the colors, and the metaphors that I use. Uh, the second mode is the one that I'm probably in most, and uh, I call that the play mode, where I get in that mindset where I'm just experimenting and playing and discovering new things and trying to make something different. Um, and currently, I, I have been scouring the internet for different sounds, uh, really obscure rhythms or folk songs, um, and sometimes even animal sounds to, to see if it can, you know, uh, spark some inspiration or take my music in a different direction. My creative journey has been a little bit all over the place. Um, my parents are not musicians, so I don't come from a musical family, but we did play music a lot at home and we sang a lot in harmony and parts, uh, to be honest, because we couldn't really afford to do anything else at that time. Um, but it was such a great introduction to vocal arrangement and, uh, and it has influenced my work up to now. So... Eventually, uh, I, I joined a couple of bands and then um, spent some years on a development deal which helped to put me on the path to uh, professional music making. I'm Canadian and I was born in Montreal, but I spent uh, a portion of my childhood years and my teenage years in Singapore and Malaysia. Uh, we were traveling back and forth a lot. So yeah, now I'm, I'm back in Toronto. I'm based here in Toronto for my music, uh, but I'm lucky enough to call three different countries home. There's an incredible creative community here in Toronto um, that is not only talented, but also very diverse. Uh, whatever culture, or subgenre you're looking for, you're probably going to find it here. And so I found making music here to be really inspiring with a lot of room for collaborations and for growth as well. <laughs> <laughs> 